So the new Idaho hands free cell phone law has been on the books for nearly a month now and drivers unfortunately are still finding themselves using their phones behind the wheel. Idaho News 6 reporter uh, Alex Grant has more tonight on what the new law has meant for the Twin Falls Police Department. The Twin Falls Police Department has been trying to get the word out of this new law as best they can. While they have seen slight progress in reducing the usage of phones behind the wheel, there is still more work to be done. Plenty of people that are still using their, their phones based on the old law, so we, we do see it quite a bit. Uh, we're still letting people adjust and, and doing warnings. Educating the public is the main goal of the department. Town hall meetings are not a viable option due to COVID-19, so the police have utilized social media. The goal is, is try to try and explain what is prohibited, what is allowed, um, maybe steer them in a different direction uh, so that they can be in compliance with the law while still driving safely. While the law can be enforced, right now only warnings can be given because there is a grace period where tickets won't start being issued until January of 2021. However, if other laws are broken while someone is on their phone, police can act accordingly. If somebody uh, makes a lane change without using their signal because they've got their hand on their phone, uh, we can issue the violation for that. It doesn't have to be a distracted driving ticket. The police are aware that they too are responsible for following the law and are trying to be safe when using their equipment. We recognize that we can be distracted too, and so our goal is, is to use um, our devices, which may it be a computer, it might be our phones. We want to use those as safely as possible. In Twin Falls, I'm Alex Grant, Idaho News 6.